go to school yeah. now uh, if you go to school who is going to take care of the house the children and the rest of the things that you do here well, I will be doing the chores just as normal just so I'll be going to school and learning and then come back home and do everything okay okay well but we don't have money now when we will have the money, we will send you to school. You can go now. You can go. Breakfast is not yet set. <laughs> hey. I'm sure this useless girl must be trying me. Let me go get her. Where is she? What is that girl? What are you doing still doing in bed here? What are you doing here at this time of the day? You were supposed to get up this morning and prepare breakfast. What are you still doing here? I'm sorry, Mom. My head is aching. What are you talking about? My head. Get out from bed and, and make the breakfast for us. Quickly. My head is aching. My head is aching. Hurry up. Sorry, getting late. Things don't work here like that. You got to work. Whether you like it or not. When you finish washing the, the, the when you finish washing the dishes, I've packed some clothes there. Wash all the clothes and when you finish washing them, iron them. Then when you finish iron, ironing them, pick up the money from the table, go to the market, buy vegetables, buy meat, and then you come back and cook lunch. Make sure you do these things on time. Who do not understand the meaning of that video? Let me make it clear. Children should not be subjected to child labor. Every child deserves to be happy. Treat every child around you with love and care whether they are yours or not all children deserve to be happy your treatment of children is unacceptable if you willingly accept or you take a child from someone to live with that child do not subject that child to child labor
do not allow a child to do all the house chores, washing clothes, cleaning, cooking, because he or she is not your own. And then allow your own children to just sit. It's unacceptable. All children deserve the right to be educated. If you are living with a child and you don't have the means to educate that child, at least show them some love. Make them to understand the situation. Let them understand that they deserve to be educated. But because you are financially down, that cannot be handled now. But there is a way to tell the child to let the child not feel bad. This is to everybody who is living with a child, be it yours or not. All children deserve the right to be happy.